Workflow Builder is a self-serve tool that empowers innovation teams to build their own AI-powered workflows tailored to the way their organizations actually work. Let's build an example workflow that uses conditional logic to analyze a supply agreement and tailor the output based on whether you're representing the buyer or the supplier. The first step for any workflow is giving it a name, tags, and a description. This helps others understand what it does and how to find it once published. Click Add Step to start building your workflow. We'll start with a file upload block that asks the user to submit the agreement to analyze. You can specify both the number and type of files allowed. Give this file a descriptive label so you can easily reference it as context later in the workflow. Next, we'll add a selection list block that asks the user, are you representing the buyer or the supplier? We can use the conditional block to route the user based on their response. Each track can be designed to reflect how your firm approaches buyer and supplier side analysis. Let's build the buyer track first. We'll add a prompt block asking Harvey to identify the top 10 red flags for the buyer and to propose amendments that would improve buyer flexibility. You can structure this prompt to reflect the kinds of insights your firm typically surfaces in these agreements. We'll anchor the prompt in the supply agreement context. You have the flexibility to select the most appropriate model for the task or allow Harvey to optimize the choice for you. Let's label the resulting output buyer analysis. We end this track with a response block that displays the analysis to the user. Now let's create the supplier track. This prompt asks Harvey to both identify where buyer obligations could be expanded and assess clauses where the supplier's responsibility could be limited. Here we also can ask Harvey to suggest alternative language for warranty liability and indemnity clauses modeled after the language your firm prefers to use or recommend in these scenarios. We'll again use the supply agreement as context and label the output supplier analysis. We'll finish this track with a response block to display the analysis. Before sharing, you can test your workflow end-to-end -to, -end to ensure it reflects your firm's standards and delivers results aligned with your best practices. Let's run the workflow and see both paths in action. When buyer is selected, Harvey generates a clear list of red flags and proposed amendments, each backed by citations. You can easily export or share the results for further review. When supplier is selected, Harvey not only provides the same clause level analysis, but also offers refined language for warranties, liability, and indemnity clauses, plus a summary table for quick comparison and decision making. You also control who can view, run, or edit each workflow, giving you full oversight of how it's used. When you're ready, hit publish to make it available across your organization. You can come back and update and refine your workflow anytime. That's just one example of the power of Workflow Builder. If you can define the process, you can build the workflow.